to watch and pray. So that is why, as a leader, you know, designing some of these things, the Lord has been leading us to pray for ourselves. It's good to pray to protect yourself. It's good to pray and block every unforeseen project. Today, I'll be dealing with projections. Projections. And I will just speak for a few minutes, like five to ten minutes, and then we'll start to pray. Projections are, are you know, a kind of supernatural manifestation that one never assume or never think of. You know, when we even uh, budgeting and they tell you do projections, you plan against uh, you, you, you plan against any unfortunate event that may occur or something. So you plan against, so you project ahead that because of uh, unforeseen adventures or unforeseen issues, you want to make room or preparation towards that. But when it comes to demonic projections, there are projections where you as a child of God, as an individual, you don't know when it will occur. They, they do those things in the realms of the spirit against you. So whilst you are just there and uh, apparently doing nothing, when I say doing nothing, you just live a normal Christian life, go to church, read the Bible, drop the Bible Sunday, and live your normal life. They are, they are, they are manufacturing or devising evil plots, trying to create things that they will shoot at you unawares. So you'll be there, you know, like you went to, I mean, go to bed, you wake up in the morning, you will start having strange migraine, and strange migraine will lead to, I mean, all sort of strange diseases, I mean, and you be in the middle, please don't go far, be in the middle. And then they will bring all sort of sickness. Sometimes someone say, I, I went to bed, I wasn't feeling pain in my hand. Now I just can't lift my hands up. I can't lift my hands up. My hands is down. You know, it's becoming weaker and weaker. I, I, I just, we just pray with a colleague. We just pray with a colleague. And he's a pastor. It's, it's amazing. And all this why we used to say that, Charlie, we have to gather and pray. We've been praying for people, praying for people's to, uh, issues and all that. And, and I mean, she, she, he brought about a, his wife. The wife wasn't well. And it's strange. The wife's hand was shrinking and shrinking and becoming smaller, smaller. You know, they've done tests and all those things. The hand keeps dropping smaller and smaller. And nobody, I mean, knew what was going wrong. And the wife was sick. The, my, my brother with a friend was worried. In fact, I, wasn't, I didn't know about it until... Uh, Monday, this past day, Monday or so, yes, Sunday, uh, Sunday, no, it was, I think uh, Thursday that they told me that is, so, and it was another colleague pastor. So he said, oh, so, Prof, you are a prophet, we didn't know this is what is happening, you have not seen our brother, for that. this is the reason. So I said, okay, then let's pray small. So he said, we interceded for him, he sat in my office. And whilst we were praying, immediately we started praying, you know, names started coming up. Who is Asa, Asa, Bia, so, 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 who is Abe, so, so, so. When I mentioned, so, okay, the first name is the one, my wife, the one we are praying. Then I mentioned the second one. And so it's the auntie of the one we are praying for. I say, yeah, then I'm, I'm going here. <laughs> and, you know, and things happen. <laughs> so whilst we were praying, I saw that they put something that black, bazaar, and the abdomen, basa, basa, basa. So I gave them direction after prayer. I said, when you go home, put a note to her, make sure you give me communion to drink, blah, 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 and all that. But the most amazing, so I was tired from here on Sunday just to get home, and then my phone rang when I was with my wife in the hall trying to ring, 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 ring. I picked the line, and that was my friend. Do you know what he said? Me, I believe that the Lord is supposed to take her from her but they end up pulling about two gallons of water from the lungs. The lungs. Two gallons. And it was dirty water. From the lungs. So the lungs supposed to deal with hair. That's why sometimes when you, you lie where you don't, then you, 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 your breathing is not correct. It can choke you and then you see. And it's a very sensitive area. But all my life, I have not heard of drawing water from the lungs. The witches, <laughs> Yanu, the evil planets, has dropped gallons of wrong water in the land. So it's 
the respiratory, is it on the, uh, on the system? Where the, the hair enters to breathe well. So if you don't breathe well, it can choke you and all those things. So it is a system designed not for water. So when they were doing all the tests and all those things, they were not seeing anything. The Yanum, Yanum have put the thing in the hidden place. <laughs> when they pour the thing, it's like flames and flames and down at the air. So if not for the direction of prayer, it's all projections. Strange places you don't imagine. That's where they project you. I hope you are getting me. Strange places. Oh. Strange places. Recently, I told one of our people, you, you like driving here. You like driving to this side. Pass here, pass here. Don't pass here this week. Pass there. Hala for you. You know? You know? I don't know whether I feel sure cause him to forget. He passed there one day. And they immediately shot him and took his car. So, evil projections are there. Don't joke with it. And I don't know why God in this fasting is leading us to pray. There are a lot of evil in the system. There is a lot of things, evil things. Social media is bombarded with evil and wrong. So, you Everywhere you turn, evil. And this is, is a demonic activation to cause many to lose the kingdom. So your focus will go on those things, fighting. I mean, and uh, the, now every social media, you see a woman with a bonbon, shaking his bonbon, bang, bang. So you know that is the last. That is what they can get the young people. Quick money, all sorts of things. I mean, now juju men are their life. Come, come and take blood money. Come and find anything. Recently, twins have killed their friend. They have run away from I mean, what evil. And these are projections. And if you ask me, I can tell you that those doing those things, it's not their intention to do that, but it was a projection that lured them, influence, demonic influence. And we are praying tonight that any form of projection against your life, may the Lord help you to escape them. I'll prove it to you in the Bible. First scripture we are reading, and please write all these scriptures. When you go and pray with them, don't stop praying. So we are dealing with evil projection or demonic projections. Evil or demonic projections. Psalm 21, verse 11. If we can project, let's project to us. Psalm 21, verse 11. Though they intended evil against you and devised a plot. It's what it said. They intended evil against you and divided a plot. Psalm 21, verse 11. Write it. Pray, pray this dawn. Pray this night. Midnight. I mean, Psalm 21 verse 11. It said, though they plot evil against you. Other verses said, though they intended evil against you. I like this one. It said, though they plot evil against you and devise wicked schemes. No, these are all projections. And devise wicked schemes, they cannot succeed. Oh, I thought you would say amen to this one. No, it's a straight command, it's a straight declaration. Though they plot evil and plan evil schemes, they shall not succeed. They, they cannot succeed. Isaiah 7, 7, shall not stand, neither will it come to pass. Every agenda of the wicked. This is straightforward. This one, no can, no ten. They will plot evil, but they cannot succeed. And then tells us, they can succeed. Though. This creature is for people who are serious, who pick it and pray. When you pray before, they will not succeed. But if you are lazy, eating bagu and drinking soup, and you go to bed snoring, they will succeed. In fact, they will cut off your leg first, chop off one breast, give you cancer, put everything in your head because you are snoring and sleeping. But immediately, let me tell you something. Every, every manual that you see on the earth has something it must operate. Are you hearing me? You can buy 75-inch curved TV and they'll give you manual and give you the remote. If you don't use the manual, the TV will be nice, but it will be a status in your room. If you don't activate scripture, the devil will win. Please don't be deceived. You are snoring, what is it? You are not doing this. You are not going to do that. In fact, they will start with your nose. They will cut off your nose and start with your head. I mean, uh -huh. But he said, if you activate scripture, though they plot, it means they will plot. Ah, where are the English scholars? I went to Saito school. He said, though they plot evil against you and devise wicked schemes. I don't want to say they, they, uh, they devise wickedness. They cannot succeed. I don't want to say they will not succeed. Tonight, that's our first prayer point. Whatever projection they have against you in the realms of the spirit, whatever projection they have against your health, they have against your finances, we are declaring scripture against them that they will not succeed. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Hey, I've seen visions, though. But some of the things that when you hear, when you see, I shock you. My friend, I couldn't sleep. I said, ah, I was just my wife, yeah. 
gallons of water. For 20 minutes, I could ask gallons of water. Hey, gallons in the, in the lands, gall, gallons of water. No correct water, no drinkable water, no pure water. Dirty phlegm, then, I mean, but how can phlegm enter your, I mean, I, sometimes you, you yourself, as a prayer guy, as a pastor, you see some of the revelation, you marvel. So my friend said, the oil here, I said, to rub here in the communion. In here, the, the wine started feeling on this, and that's why they rushed to do that thing. And then when they poured it, the thing was coming. One gallon finished. Fried tall gallon, not the round one, not the square one. They finished. They brought another gallon, finished, and a second gallon. I mean, can you imagine? If so, today, you send fire into their camp. Whatever plot, is, is it whatever plot, though they plot evil against you, and evil, they are types, and divide, the word divide means they project, they have skin, they have agenda, they have structures. Are you hearing me? So when you start praying to your background, we are breaking their structures, their devices. When you are bedroom, you have bedroom, you have three bedrooms, I mean, self contained you call it, that nothing. You have bedroom, you have a hall, you have kitchen, you have washroom, where they bath, same fire everywhere. Yes. I told you, may her so rest, one of my aunties, we used to pray, he would, pray, he would, just, he would scatter my prayer meeting for me. He would pray and send fire everywhere, including the nostrils of the devil. Every part, wherever they are, when you are smoking a rat out, you don't put fire in at the entrance of the hole. Wherever there is hole, you put you pinpoint fire, you put fire there. Today, wherever they are, we'll put fire there. I said we'll put fire there. Are you ready for prayer? He said, say, though they plot evil against you and devise wicked schemes, they would they cannot succeed. Psalm 37, verse 7. The next scripture, Psalm 37, verse 7 says, Rest in the Lord. And wait patiently for him. Do not fret because of him. He's talking about the devil who prosper in his own ways because of the man who carry out wicked projections. He said, wicked schemes to pass. Wicked projections. Evil projections. Today is projections. When we finish, we'll take the communion to be a preservation. Remember, it's a matter of preservation. That's how our prayer is going like that. If you are followed carefully, you know. As a, as a father of the house, and God has given us a direction. So, this month of July, it has been protection, rejection, back to sender. It's all about preservation. Are you hearing me? Next scripture. It said, it will never, because of the man who brings wicked schemes to pass. It will never happen. It will never happen. It will never happen. Look at the next one. Ezekiel 11 verse 2. He said to me, son of man, these are the men who devise iniquities and give evil advice in this city. This was the prophet of God when God was showing him the wicked men in the city. You know, the enemy has encamped the city and wicked. They are boiling the, they are boiling men at the entrance of the gate. And by revelation, the Lord showed the prophet. He said, these are the men, the men you are seeing tonight. You may not see a vision, but in the rest of the spirit, as you lift up prayer, may the Lord expose them and your prayer will target them. Your prayer will get them. They are wicked men of the land. I'm telling you, these politicians, they operate with sorcery and all sorts of things. They do abomination and it affects people. But the Bible says that though there was, Egypt was dry, there was Goshen where God was preserving his people. You can be in Ghana and no evil can come near you because you are praying right. And tonight we'll pray right. We'll pray right. They are everywhere in our workplace, wicked men. And then he said to me, son of man, these are the men who devise iniquity. There are people who always plan wickedness among God's people. Remember the scripture, Ezekiel, I mean, it said, Jeremiah 5 verse 2, he said, they are wicked men, evil men among my people. I'm telling you, if you stop this prayer now, wow, I can do point one, point two, but this is not a season for me. This is the season where you have to do. So say, I know, I, I do a beer. when you are working in town, you have to be growing tough. Convert yourself the blood because somebody can just shoulder you like this and he's taking virtue away. You know, gone are the days in school. So I, when I was preaching in secondary school, I catch witches. You see somebody will see somebody check. Boy. Then when it's intelligent, the next witch will sit and he'll take your virtue. Then whilst you are calculating, you are calculating back, 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 back. No, I'm born because you are very good. Somebody have taken your virtue. So I used to catch them. You are a witch. Get up. Why do you take a fear virtue? Then you will confess it. You know? Today, you carry Bible, you put in a, a designer bag. Those days, we, we fire on the street. 
Kobaraka, this generation, they are not firing. They are having sex on the street. They are drinking beer on the street. They are shaking women bum bum. They are squeezing teeth on the street. They are kissing on the street. For the foolish things they are doing. So the devil is also killing them by heart. People come to church and they carry Bible in brown and blue. Can you imagine? But that your promise ring and the smooching is never in a brown envelope. I used to cry, I used to see my own When the same Bible said that be filled with the Holy Spirit, who oh, can give me four but to know about so it's normal. Please, it is not normal in this church. It is not normal. Maybe God forgive you because you will be Papa, so God says you shouldn't drink. I'm not saying drinking. Not that people watch me say, Papa, so there wouldn't be one day crown who can say myself in some to preach in the one can say. Man, can't say any year. Because I know that I'm a brown. But when I say break, the thing is not breaking. Because there are 14 bottles of beer in your tummy. The Holy Spirit don't have power in the chamber to break. So I'll keep saying it until you become fed up with the guineas and the beer. And these days it's terrible. The women are consuming more than the men. And there's more women in the church than men. Yes. Now it's bitter. Now, now the ladies love. There's a, now Smenov has advanced to other drinks. Yeah. Darling lemon, darling so so and so. You know, they are coughing like something. Now, you see, any dress they wear and the color of wine they will drink. Yes. There are some, it's in plain glass, like the smell of bottle. Now, there are different types of bottles. Different types. It is pink, it is wine. So, all the ladies, or certainly dress on shirts, they are purple, or they purple drink. When they finish, they are, they are, the people are in the first church with plenty of problems for us to cast. But thank God this, they are not a fool again. I will check their spirit. The Bible says, scan their spirit and see that which you can help. So I check if you have 14 bottles, I say pray, 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 pray. I make sure that you will gout all the, the beer. You must be serious with prayer. Evil men everywhere. It's a son of man. These are the evil men who devises iniquity in the city. Wicked counsel. Wicked counsel. Now it's easy. Now the girls go to their bosses. I don't have a job. Yeah, says but we all enjoy the sex. Let's do it and give me the job. We can become co- the devil is sending new spices. Spices. The enemy has has you know infiltrate the whole city with a new smoke, a new smell called demonic spices. It forms like desires of the flesh. But as we pray today, whatever the enemy has orchestrated, you stand in the blood of Jesus. You take rescue in the blood. And will frustrate their devices. If for men, please, if they are everywhere. They are at your workplace. They are everywhere. They are everywhere. People you work with, call colleagues, they want to kill you for your for, for, for promotion. I was walking on the street somewhere praying, and I saw blood. God told me there's blood everywhere on our streets. People are killing for so many unnecessary reasons. People are killing their own brothers. You see, the wickedness is too much. Wickedness is too much. So you, the righteous, if the environment you are working is full of wicked men, you will see yourself struggling to prevail. So you have to pray that God locate me at the rightful place. Because sometimes, eh, where we are working, there's so much evil that you can't prevail. You can't, you can't move forward. So you can be there for 14 years and you are so proud foolishly that I've been here 14 years with no promotion, nothing to show. The same television, the handbag you have been watching for 14 years. That's the same TV there. And you even use it as historical background to tell me, ah, yeah. To tell your story. No, 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 no. Evil man. Evil man. Somebody say evil man. But we'll pray tonight. Our last scripture, Ezekiel 9, verse 25, talk about Haman. Look at the wicked things. Amen. And he was in the king's court. Too. So can you imagine this one being the counselor to the king? Sorry, Esther. Sorry, Esther. I said, I said what? My boy for off. Esther 925. He was on the king's court. Amen. And he was a, can you imagine? He was a counselor to the king. Too. So a wicked man became a counselor. What good can he give the king? So on home show and so David top EFL, I know you're talking about on finance and so on top EFL. Can't tell the king said if you strip strip him naked, king, this boy if you don't strip naked, you come and take your throne. Look at the shirt he's wearing, designer shirt, designer shirt. You know this one you don't wear some. Strip him naked. Look at your boss. People envy you know and they go, especially the serpents in the offices. There are a lot of serpents. 
no slave queen or slow W or whatever it is. They are all serpents. They, 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 they throw their, to your, their tongue around the, the ears of their master. Then they make him to me. He said, this guy is too new. I come and say, sack him. Sack him. Then you are there. They'll give you letter for no reason. Your boss will see you now. He will, he will squeeze. But in the morning, he saw you and said, oh, you are looking great, Belinda. Hey, you are looking great, uh, David. But in the afternoon, the tongue has gone ahead. Wicked men. Please, you have to do with it too. Me, I started praying. The way pastors, people are dying. One of our pastors died recently. The way the, the evil things, you are there and people are creating evil things around you. Why you even sleep? Watch the, the, your next door neighbor. They the, the are evil. People drop things. You know, and go betide you if you are in a compound house. Your case worse. It's a worse one. But the next day, the next this the door is a witch. The next door, they are everything. And they are all into all sorts of things. Now people are consulting everything to make money. So once you are coming to church and you are doing normal church, there are people who go for places for things. You see them in the land cruiser, nowhere near about, hey, you're riding to the that. So they, they put this unnecessary stress on you. Why? When you allow wicked men to rule in the nation, what happens is that the righteous perish. I pray that you will not perish. God has opened your eyes tonight. He said, deal with them, for their plans will not stand. Their plans will not stand. So when you, are, when you go to an area and you don't create an atmosphere for you, they will create the, the, the atmosphere for you. That is why it's very necessary. Con I mean, make your place so conducive for yourself. Everywhere you go, because of wicked men, having this knowledge, make sure that nobody will come near your dwelling with an evil spirit. In fact, the, if, if you are a light, darkness should not come near you. But some of us are 50 50. So one can say, oh, yeah, do so, do so, do so, do so, do so, do so, do so. So people see as a light, and then when you are darkness, 50 50. When I'm back, we are saying, I'm going to say, that's it. Oh, two new man, my own self, yes, to grab a sunny, but Oka Bonsan says, who are also your champion, also. God doesn't even know where you are. You don't even know where you are. But tonight, evil projection. You see, young guy, die. now look at those who are dying. 30, the, 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 the last time I saw was 52. And it's when you are, no, no. 30, 35. They are dying, basa, basa, basa. 40. He is not doing building. He has not finished his house. Ah, they take him. Evil protection everywhere. And please, I'm telling you this because I'm a prophet of God and I know the spirit. I know what I'm saying. I know. In UPI, I, I live at the way now. Now from my house, we pray until I get to the office. When I'm walking, praying everywhere. Because somebody's projection for something. He has done evil. He's gone to an altar and projected to get some money. Or projected to get some riches or some contrast sign. When they do the, the incantation and the rituals, they really leave it into the atmosphere. And innocent blood is what they are looking for. So if you are not careful and you are not praying and you are not in the spirit, they throw their thing and their thing catch you. Some of you will just insult your children and send them to school. No prayer cover, nothing. So when, when there's evil projection, it affects people. Affect your family. But today, we are praying. Wherever the projection is coming from, the ones who do not know, a gentleman walked to my office last week. He walked and the leg was shaking. He said, Papa, my leg is shaking. I said, why is your leg shaking? He said, I came here. It wasn't like that in the morning. But I said, huh? He is going to step on something. Not too far at the entrance. Because the spirit men who are not po are even poor and are not serious are fighting over a small travel. So they are putting things there. Then he is not say person. He has no prayer. He is just there. A normal church goer. And step on it. So I said, "Now who are you also for no one money?" But I said, "Give me another So I said, "Why is your leg shaking?" He said, "Papa, I don't know. It's shaking." And you can see the leg shaking. It is not strong. The leg was shaking. And I said, "Why well, you don't pray?" Oh, sorry, I said, "I didn't know you pray to go." He said, "Papa, I prayed." Ah. <laughs> I said, "You know, so I have to pray." I said, "Okay, let me pray." I said, "When I got said, put cold water on it, that's it." I said, "Remove water from my feet." I said, "Okay, Papa." And I told my boys, and there's three good in so when they put, ah, ah, I say, hey, I'm going to ah, I'm going to do it, I say, ah, I say, how are you? You know, I say, ha, ha, you feel it, so I'm fine now. That thing stop. I say, how is it? He said, before the water dropped, the leg was shaking, not only alone. You see, when a, a, a fighter, oil is poured on you, the pain is different. 
when iron is pressed on you, the pain is different. If you put your leg in, in fire, the inside, the pain is different. So it's like the leg has been put in fire and you can feel pain. The pain is not normal, this thing. So when the water was pouring, it's like, choo, you feel like when you put water on iron and you'll be, shh, shh. so that is how he was feeling. Next time when you come, come like that. So there are some of us, we, we just leave the house like that, come like that. We go to the office, eating with everybody. Okay, hey, boy, you boy, call and say, talk to your mommy. No protection, nothing. No, no man after the flesh. The Bible says the world we live in are full of wicked men. Be wise. Be wise. Tonight, projection. 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 The next 30 minutes, we are closing at 8. Last week, close it. The next 30 minutes prayer. Father, any projection against my life, three, against my, my, my destiny, whatever you have for me, my prosperity, my health, blah, 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 blah. Lord, let it be fire. Let it be fire. The last scripture, I just told you about him. Put it there. I like the last verse. And that's our, our last prayer. You know, Hester 9 verse 25. It said, it say, but when it came to the king's attention, that is about Naaman raising the gallows to hang the head of Mordecai. It said, when it came, okay. So, but when Esther came before the king, he commanded by a letter that this wicked plot, which Haman has devised against the Jews, should return on his own head. That's our prayer. You can read the rest. Me, I'm done with this one. It must return on their own heads. Every projection against your life. If there are projections that is not for you, but you enter into it, and the trap catch you, caught you, the trap, the trap caught you. Projection that you are not aware of, and it trapped you. Evil projection. Against my destiny, against my life. I saw some video, and that's my last thing of prayer. Some video, TikTok video circulating. A, a man, who, a young man who has prayed that he traveled to the U.S. He prayed, 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 and God answered the prayer. But you know, he was poisoned by friends. And when he got to America, no, he died. And they retained his dead body. The mother was crying like this. They poisoned him. He said, oh, friends, today they are going to be here. And those friends poisoned him. Yes. Who should get to you as you are going to be to Hindu guy? And you know, the painful thing, the other uncle who was going to hire him, so uncle in the Nanko He had entered America, checked out, and was waiting for the, 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 these people to come, the, whoever, for the family to come and pick him. And he could lie. He started vomiting blood, vomiting blood at the airport. American airport too. So he saw them cold, but he never enjoyed it. Everybody is your friend. You have no barrier, you have no space. Everybody is your friend. Oh, sister, if you have one friend, say, yeah, I should go and go and follow him. Go and go and help him in this phone now. In the airport, go and ask a crown. If you and a few also say, a few also told me tomorrow we are going to a party. So you from party to phone now. Phone now to party. So this friend, this friend, this friend. There are times you need to separate yourself and wait on God for him to guide you. Rise up on your feet. Projections. Projection. Are you ready for prayer? I, I know I've talked plenty, but it is very necessary. Yes. Sometimes you, somebody will come close to you and you yourself see that, mm, this friend cried, this person and poor friend. Mm. Not anywhere, even in church, you know that I you shouldn't cry for concerning the idea. You can say I'm not afraid to hear to see any other back on Baku Babakun with wisdom. Are you hearing me? Yes. Are you ready for prayer? Lift up your right hand. 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 Say Lord Jesus. Oh, I can't hear you. Say Lord Jesus. I thank you for my life. This evening, as I lift up prayer, I declare by your word that anyone who intended evil against my life and divide a plot 
devise a plot against me. Your word says in Psalm 21 verse 11 that it will not succeed. As I lift that prayer, as I clap my hands, as I stamp my feet and lift up prayer, let those who have plotted evil, let every evil projection against my life never succeed. In the name of Jesus, wherever it's coming from, in my workplace, in my residence, the area I live, wherever it's coming from, from my paternal background, from my maternal background, wherever it's coming from, as I clap and pray, let it go back to sender. May the applaud never succeed. May the projection fail. Clap your hands and begin to pray. Let your projection fail. I know you can be serious than this one. Lift up your voice. Walking the sun, walking on the spirit, three of them just, I get back in no. Lift up your voice. Paratasa. I know you can do better than this one. Barunda Kusa. Pray. 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 Lift up your voice and pray. Lift up your voice and pray. Rako Sakata. Barako Miniatosa. Fakato Farakata. I can't hear you.
Masata bara 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 kama raba sanne na raba sanne ke lo barando fia faruka tusa fara tusa fara tusa fara tusa fire in the name of Jesus wherever they are coming from wherever they are fire of the Holy Ghost fire of the Holy Ghost locate them locate them let their protection be destroyed. Let their protesters be destroyed. Let every agenda against my life, whatever they are projecting against my life, whatever they are projecting against the church, whatever they are projecting against my family, let it by fire. Evil protesters, evil protesters, we command their protesters to by fire. Let it 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 by fire. Where I'm at, I'm at a rakata. Sabranda la bato. Sebranda la la basa. Rapa rapa tapa. Rapa sonda rapa. Rapa toba rakata. Let the agenda fail. Katunda sana. Open your mouth and pray. Drop your hands. Stop your feet. Pray. 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 Every evil protection. It will not succeed. Lord, whatever evil protection they are protecting against my life, against my house, against my life, wherever they are protecting it from, from my workplace, from my father's background, from my mother's background, from the area I live, among this church, Baratasa, Baratasa, Amarota, Berukata, Amaranasa, wherever, wherever, La Kwataye, La Kwataye, La Kwataye, La Kwataye, La Kwataye, Shabada, Shabanda Labada, Rabanda Lababa, Rabanda Lababa, Rabanda Lababa, Wanda Lababa, Yapa 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 Don't stop praying, don't stop praying. Lift up your voice. I can't hear you. Lift up your voice. Stop their protection. 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 Yasada Bada. Rabata Bada. Rabata Bada. Rabata Bada. Rabata Bada. In the name of Jesus. I know you are doing well, but you can do better. Lift up your voice. Don't get tired. Drop your hands. Stop those hands. Stop your feet. Pray against them. Evil protection. Evil protection. Evil protection against my health, against my life, against my ministry, against my finances, against my marriage, against my children. In the name of Jesus, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire. In the name of Jesus, by fire, by fire, by fire, are you tired? Are you praying? Lift up your voice. Lift up your voice and pray. Fire everywhere. Fire everywhere. Fire there. Fire here. Fire there. Fire here. Fire there. Fire in your hometown. Fire in your father's background. Fire in your mother's background. Fire here. Fire there. Bakada balakata. Rabakata pa. Rabakata paya. Rabakata ya. In the name of 
Jesus. In the Rabasa, Rabadabada, Rabadabada, Yekolaba, Sabadada, Saba, Bradada Badabada, Bradabada Badabada, Bradabada Badabada, Bradabada Badaba, Bradabalabada, Sabarabalabasa. Yakataba, 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 Rabada Bada, Rabada Bada, Brata Balosa, Brata Mosa, Brata Mosa, Sara, Yavara Bada 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 Don't stop praying. You are doing something. You are getting somewhere. I see you prevailing. I see you prevailing. I see you prevailing. You are going down on You are prevailing. You are prevailing. You are succeeding. You are prevailing. You are succeeding. My son, Davantus, Branta Sotata, Branta Sotata, Branta Sapato, Rapato Sapato, Rapato Sapato, Yakatuda, Parabarabasa, 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 Yakuda, Yakatuda, Paratuda, Paratusa, Paratusa, Rapaka, Rakapa, Rakapa. Yekotaya, 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 Yabaraba, 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 Yabatosa, Yabaraba, Kosa, Baruta, Baruta, Payakata, Don't stop praying, lift up your voice, lift up your voice, Shabaraba, Yabaraba, it's a war cry. It's a war cry. Look up your voice. It's a season of warfare. It's a season of warfare. Paluata, Paluata, Paluakata, Parabarabasa, Patuan de Kusa, Peluakata, Peluakata, Pequata, Palukata, 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 Fire. You are winning the battle. Clap your hands. Stop for free. Lift up your voice. Glory. That devil is giving up. That devil is a liar. You are preparing. In Akatua. Bakatua. 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 Yabarabarabas. 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 Bakata. 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 Jesus. I said in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Listen, our next prayer topic. Whoever is hidden within the family, projecting evil against people who are progressing. Today, let us from and fall. Uh, you didn't hear what I said. I said, anyone who is a strong man, hidden in your family, Hidden in your place of work to make sure you will not progress, to make sure he will continue to battle your life. God has given you authority. He said, I have given you power that whatever you bound on this earth shall be bound. 
and whatever you lose shall be loose. He said, wherever your feet shall tread, you shall possess. For you are the son of God. You are the son and the daughter of Yahweh. As we lift up prayer, wherever they are hidden in your life, let fire enter there. Lift up your right hand. Say, in the name of Jesus, whosoever is hidden in my family, in my father's family, in my mother's family, in my place of work, in the territory I live, projecting evil against my life, projecting evil against my progress, projecting evil against my health, against my academics, against my husband, against my wife, against my marriage, against my life. In the name of Jesus, as I lift up prayer, as the king said, as the king said, that the evil of him, as the king said, as the king said, that the evil of him should return to him as I lift up prayer. Whosoever is projecting evil against me, against my family, and he or she, and he or she is hidden in the family, around my territory, at my workplace, whoever he is, whoever he is, whoever she is, as I clap and pray, let their protection return back to them. Return back to them. Return back to them. Clap your hands and pray. Let the projection return back. Let their evil return. Let their projection return. Shop on the fire. Let the evil return. Let the evil return back to them. Fire, 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 fire everywhere. Let their evil return. Let their evil return to them. Whatever Sada. Branta Bada Bada Bada. Shabara Bada Bada. Makotasa. Makotasa. Makoria. Maseria. Belwakate. Belwakate. Shabara Bada Bada. Yabara Bada Bada. Kapatosa. Ekwara Baso. Ekwara Fire, fire, la pato sata, belwa kato sapa, mandele baso, mandele baso, ma katonda, faru sate, faru atosa. My God, my God, let there be a release. Pado, 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 pado. Are you praying or doing something like prayer? Open your mouth and pray. Return it, 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 return it. Return it, return it. Shabarabah, Yabarabah, Sada, Brekatunda, Belwakata, 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 Ekatunda, 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 Ekatunda,
you will feel like going back, going back to school. God will correct every error. That the, give me oil. God will correct every error that the enemy, I mean, causes you. The money manipulation. Sometimes you feel like, why should I, why am I even among women, among human beings? Sometimes you feel like, ah, why, 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 why me? Why me? Why me? The frustration there be bringing you. Huh? What I'm saying doesn't make sense to you. Huh? It makes sense. In what, in what form? In what form? Come here. Come here. Come. Come here. Thank you, Father. No, I'm listening. It makes sense, eh? Things have been bizarre before. My dear lady, I'm, I'm, I'm with you. Don't think I've gone far away. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I see an angel dropping oil on you. And the angel was telling me that you say for a long time. You say. I don't know whether you are with somebody you stay with or is it a family you stay with or you are with people. Mm -hmm. eh? With somebody. You say for a long time. God is changing your destiny. Because you have said, he will favor you. Before this year will end, doors will start opening. After the 40 days of fasting, God, I see you serving. Very honest in your serving. God said, your life has not ended. You will not end through like, throughout your life like that. It's changing things around. It's turning things. Favor will locate you. Somebody will, will bless you. I see a two-bedroom house. They will bless you. Somebody will, will take you as a son. He will bless you. Thank you, Lord. Makubarashata ekubrashita ivaraka. Lift up your hands for me. Thank you, Lord. Destiny is rewinding. God is rewinding the thing. It's good you came. It's good you came. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Are you tired? Yeah, don't get tired, though. It's even blue, blue. Today, program upon program. Don't get tired. Tabo shahada. Lift up your right hand for me. You can go back. Lift up your right hand for me. Something must drop upon you. Something must drop on you tonight. Every projection against you. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Lift up your hands. Father, visit your people. Anyone that has cried on you today, we pray for divine visitation. Yes, Lord. Lord, visit your people. Evil projection breaks now. Evil projection breaks now. Evil projections break now. Let your right hand, Lord, be upon your people. Let yokes be broken. Let favor be released. Let yoke be broken. Let favor be released. Let yoke be broken. Let favor be released. In the name of Jesus, we command freedom now. In the name of Jesus, we command freedom now. In the name of Jesus. Lato Barakatas. You are in school, eh? You are in school. Thank you, Lord. There's a gentleman. There's a gentleman you need to watch carefully. The enemy will, will send that gentleman, plant the gentleman in your life. Don't give that gentleman any space. Michael Afo, Afo, A F F U L, Afo, Michael Afo. Michael will come. You are not in level 400 yet. You are in 200. Michael will come level 300. He will come level 300. Michael will come. Michael Afo. Michael, Kiki, Afo. Write this name on. Don't joke. Mm, I say it, I leave it like that. You'll be looking for me, I'm gone. Put the name down. If you forget, write it close to your bed. Michael, Kiki, Afo. He will come. He will give you so many problems. Don't listen to the nonsense. He will help you. The enemy, you see, these are free spirit people that work in campus. That the enemy can use. They will use him without not knowing. Are you getting me? Tell him that you are not my taste. Go away. I'm, my taste is my books. Let me finish my my books. Huh? Let me finish my books. Because you know background. You understand. 
daddy side, and all those things. And God is the one taking care of you. So obey God. Your future is bright. But don't give chance to Michael Kweku Anso. Eh? Yes. Who is Asemeni? Is he a name? Asemeni. Asemeni. Who, who is a name? No, Asemeni. Why is Asemeni bound? Who knows Asemeni here? Why is Asemeni bound? Huh? It's your brother. Where? It's at the base. Has he been here before? I see as many tied though. I see as many tied. It's like friends, two friends send him to tie him, to use him. He's in the base. Yeah, then tell him see you Sunday. Come. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Maliba Shata Brandes. No weapon form against you shall prosper. And every arrow we condemn it in the name of Jesus. We give you praise. Roger, come. <laughs> there are some of the things I see, I don't need to say. I see you in the big pot. Is it the pot? Yes, silver, like a silver bowl, big. And covered. And I see an angel standing on the pot, lifting the pot with himself. And when you came out, you stretch. Immediately, I see that another hand carry you from that and place you down. And they started dressing you new, 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 new. God has delivered your soul from that entanglement. And immediately they were dressing you like a royal. And they were dressing you. They would put you a very nice regalia. And they were moving. And people were throwing you like a priest. Throwing things aside. God said, your struggle is over. I am bringing you out and I will prepare you before men. Watch it from August. Things will begin to change. Things begin to change. Now you've been praying some aggressive prayers of marriage. You want to settle down. And God has been praying, praying. I see you praying the night. Lord, I want to settle. Lord, I want to settle. By the end of 40 days of power, the Lord will favor you. Your time has come. Your time has come. God, that has been your prayer. I see you've written, you've written it on your bedside. I see, see marriage number one, promotion number two. <laughs> praying. No, no, I'm serious. Oh. He's praying. Settle, you know, then finish your house. Mm, God will give you favor. I say, God will grant you favor. Amen. Let me pray for the next two people. We are closing. Oh, I promise eight. Let me pray for two people here. Then I'll, I'll go. Madam, I, I said I'll continue your prophecy. Eh? Come here. Eh? There's something sensitive I must say. You brought your son. Give me oil. I was dealing, I was praying for your son. In my office. Yeah, okay, he's good, he's sleeping. Give me oil. I see the reaction. Somebody who is deeply asleep. This boy will be free. Yes. He will wake up and he will start speaking. I saw in a vision in my office when I was praying for him that the tongue came out very long and under the tongue was, what do you call this? The finger? The women, you wear those things. Huh? The nail. But it's, it's, it's a nail of a beast, though. Hanging under the tongue of this boy. And other things were followed. For, for, for God showed me. But when I started praying, I saw the tongue going back into the mouth. And that thing was removed. And God said, whatever glory they were trying to exchange. So that it will not be said that you have given birth to a glorious child. Has been reversed. And the tongue, I see the tongue of the boy going back in the spirit. And God told me, everything that was taken from him has been restored. There is work going on in the head. God is working on the head, in the head, in the mind. And things are going to be free. In Jesus' name. Mommy, what about Adam? 
Oh, okay. Obanu eh? Ah, Obanu you. You. Okay. You. I'll tell you something to do. Whatever will happen in the glory of God. It will happen to the glory of God. You agree? Hmm? Okay. So I will, I will help you. I removed the thing from your waist last time. I said I will do what? Yes. We will continue next time. Is the pain still there? The pain is still there. Hmm? I said, my do it. Oh dear. I mean, count high. Father, thank you. Everything will be fine. See, see me after service. See me. Church, are you blessed for coming? Come. Make sure nobody brings you a laptop to sell. And have you sold laptop before? Come. Make sure a friend. Come. Make sure a friend will not say that a laptop. This guy was fortunate. You were here on Sunday. When I was ministering, God was speaking. He, he was hearing that. I was saying, time is going. Give your life to Jesus. Your time is going. You heard that? Yes. And because he wasn't stubborn, immediately after service, he came here. That is how salvation is. So God told him, he can hear, your time is going. Go forward. Your time is going. Go forward. Your time is going. Go forward. And he came and prayed for him. Now, because you have prayed and have accepted the Lord, this is why God is saving you. A guy will come. Huh? Papaya, papaya, papaya will come and tell you that will this one. Make a shoot down. Make a shoot down. Make a shoot down. It's a stolen item. Don't sell it. Huh? Don't sell it. He will come with a guy called Frank. Don't sell it. Tell him I'm not interested. Eh? Don't. They, they are tracking the item as I'm speaking now. Police is tracking those things. They will catch him and catch you and they will find a way, find a way, find a way to, you know, because they are a group of people who do those business. They still and sell. But God has redeemed you. Don't go back. Tell them you are not interested. This thing I'm telling you, today is Wednesday. Latest by Saturday. This guy, watch out. Are you getting me? Watch out. Okay? Come. What do you do? Washing days. Be serious with God, eh? And things will be fine. Can I have a moment for more? Be serious on your passport now. Because they will tell you connection to travel. Don't give your heart to Jesus. Things will change. Amen. Amen. It's 8 18. I promised 8 o'clock. Amen. Sit down for me and we'll take our offering. Mr. Man, you are here. Pick your communion wine. We'll do this and we'll take our offering. Pick your communion wine. Pick your communion. You have your communion wine. Make sure if you don't have, they give you one. Rise on your feet. Where is my communion wine? Rise on your feet. Amen. I want you to take your communion wine if you are there. First Corinthians 11 verse 23. Project it for me. We are going to do this communion differently tonight. When you drink his blood and you eat his body, the Lord will preserve you. First Corinthians eleven twenty three. First Corinthians eleven twenty three. Are you there? First of all, I want you to take the body of Christ. And watch what Jesus said. He said, For I receive from the Lord what I also pass on to you. The Lord Jesus on the night he was betrayed took bread and what? gave thanks and after giving thanks he broke it and said this is my body which is for you other person which was broken for you so it means Christ's body was broken so that yours will be yours will remain intact 
that no sickness or disease will come near you. Are you getting what I'm saying? So as we partake of the body of Christ, you should know that he replaced his body for you. He took your broken body, nailed it on the cross, and gave you his body so that no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Sickness cannot stay in your body. But tonight is a night of preservation. As we partake of the body of Christ, we decree and declare that your body is preserved. You won't die prematurely. No sudden attack will come near your dwelling. No sudden sickness will, will come upon you because you bear in your body the mark of Christ. Your body represents the body of Christ. Lift it up. Say in the name of Jesus. As I partake of the body of Christ, let my body be restored. In the name of Jesus. In this sickness in this body of mine, is taken care of right now. I receive the body of Christ as I partake in this body in Jesus' name. And after he has given it and said, take and eat, for this is my body. I want you to eat the body of Christ. So as you are eating, they make declaration on it. You can pray in your head that, Lord, any sickness in my body, whatever uncomfortable situation I'm experiencing in my body, as I partake of your body, Lord, take care of it now. If fibroid is destroying you, is disturbing you, Lord, take care of it. If it is sickness in your body, whether it's cancer, whatever the enemy is trying to deposit, by tonight as you partake of the body of Christ, let that deposit be taken care of. Let May you receive your total healing, total wholeness in the name of Jesus, total deliverance in the name of Jesus. Go ahead. Mashata Balaha. Ikota, any strain pain, any strain pain, any strain event, whatever is happening in your body is giving way right now. It's the body of Christ. And pray in your head. Thank no so now. It's it. It's it. The same scripture, please, project it. The Bible says in the same manner he took the car, lift, blow that scripture. And when he had given it us, he broke it. The same way, in the same manner, he took the cup after supper, saying, this is the cup in the new covenant. Uh, it, the, this is the cup is the new covenant in my blood. Do this as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. Lift it up. Say the blood of Jesus. I can hear you. Say the blood of Jesus. The blood, the blood that is better, that is better than the blood of Abel. As I partake of the blood of Jesus, of the blood of Jesus satanic projection against my life, against my life is, broken is broken by the covenant blood of Jesus. By the covenant blood of Jesus. As I partake of this blood, I, partake of this blood I, decree and declare, I decree and declare me and my household, me and my household we, are secure, we are secure. We are preserved. We are, preserved, we are protected. We are protected. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. We are protected. We are protected. We are preserved. We are preserved. From every strange disease. From every strange disease. Every strange disease. Every strange disease. disease. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every sudden attack. Every sudden attack. Of strange diseases. Of strange diseases. Premature death. Premature death. Premature illness and whatever. Premature illness and whatever. We are free from it. We are free from it. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Covenant in our background. Covenant in our background. That is still ruling. That is still ruling. And affecting life. And affecting life. As I partake of the blood As of I Jesus. Of the blood of Jesus. I am secure. I am secure. In Jesus' name. In Jesus name. The blood of Jesus. your hands on your chest, wherever you begin to trust God, wherever you are feeling any sickness, whatever strange attack, tonight is a special night. Put your hand there and begin to declare. Place a demand on the blood of Jesus. I give you one minute. Place a demand on the blood. Place a demand on the blood. Place a demand on the blood.
Hallelujah. I want you to take a special seed in your hands. Not a normal offering. Just take a seed in your hands. It could be 50, it could be 100, it could be 20. I want you to take a seed. Everybody, let's do it. We we'll come before the altar of God and say, Lord, as I drop this seed, it's my covering. It's a sign. I'm just sowing and connecting to this altar. That whatever prayer I pray tonight will bring me a successful answer. Just take a seed in your hands. Everybody just take a seed. Everybody just take a seed. Take a seat in your hands. A mighty God like you, you are bigger than any other. Rise up, rise up, rise up. Walk and drop it on the altar. Walk and drop it. Everybody, you are bigger. for one minute. than any other God. And your word tells us, no one comes to you and go by the same. We believe that you have answered our cry. I will see all the testimonies. Lord, we are not leaving your presence the same. We pray that we are going back victorious. That every evil projection against our destiny has been destroyed in the name of Jesus. And those that need to go back to send that, you have sent it back to them in the name of Jesus. We will see the testimony. We will hear of your victory upon our lives. We will hear of the testimonies because we have answered every prayer. Now I bless you as the father of the house. May your life be blessed. In this season of 40 days of power, may the Lord give you testimonies. May the Lord give you testimonies. Every step you take, may it be blessed. In these 40 days of power, we ask that you will not be able to count your blessing because it will be numerous. It will come, it will bombard you at every side. Doors that are shut that your strength could not hold, I mean, hoping God has opened those doors. In this season of 40 days of power, the Lord will visit you with a testimony. Let the harm of flesh be cut off. Let the hand of flesh be cut off. Let the strong hand of God preserve your life and bring you all the victory as you continue to pray. Go from this place with the confident assurance in your heart that in Christ Jesus, you and your family, you are more than a conqueror in Jesus' name. You are more than conquerors in Jesus' name. You and your family, you are more than conquerors in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. Let's share the grace with the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit.